Well, welcome folks. Welcome back to the channel. It's a glorious day and the birds are going mental out here. It's brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Bass and mackerel. And uh, I've just got the rod over. I'm literally just flicking it over and uh, bagging up. It's great, absolutely great. There's birds all over the place. There's splashes all over the place. They are moving around a bit, the birds. So it is a question about moving as well. So I'm casting as well and we're getting, the, getting into some of the action, but there's splashes everywhere. It's going to be a short video. It's literally just mackerel fishing. So uh, there we go. Well, let me put that down. And let me show you the, the birds. You can see, look at all those birds, all the birds working. You hopefully you can see some splashes in the background. Absolutely cracking. Sportsman's night in the background. He's um, a charter guy, absolute cracking bass man. If you want to go bass fishing, jump on Sportsman's night out, Langston Arbor. Pete Kilshaw is the skipper. Absolutely, that, what that man don't know about bassing, well, what can I say? Anyway, let's get back into the action. <coughs> well, that didn't take long. I've got a few on for a little bit. I oh, know, just the one, actually just the one, there we go, but there we go. Never get fed up of going back with the fishing, absolutely love it. It's all the memories of being a kid, isn't it? It's when you're mackerel fishing, let me grab that mackerel, it's all swinging all over the place. I'm just putting them in the bucket of water I've got just down here. If you go mackerel fishing, and you know what it's like, it's all scowly and horrible. But I brought one of these tools and it's a little scourger and it's perfect for getting the mackerel off the feathers instead of getting your hands all over it to scowled up. I mean, perfect little tool there. You can get them from quality time uh, fishing tackle if you, if you want them. I think they're, I think they're about three or four quid somewhere around that, I can't remember, but oh, brilliant. I've got no, sca no scales, no mackerel scales on my hands whatsoever. The rod is nice and clean. Hello, dashing the boat around. So, happy days. I'll just put it down there and uh, send the rod out again. I can see a few swirls in the distance there, so we'll give it a go and see if we can get some more. I've got a few already, so I'm not gonna go mad and greedy. I'm away for a couple of days, so I can't really store too many. Um, later in the year, I will uh, go and Go and bag up a few more. I'm just going to turn the uh, VHF radio down. That's better. And uh, yeah, as I was saying, yeah, later in the year I'll go and bag up a, a load of bass. Oh, sorry, a load of mackerel for the uh, up and coming season of the winter months. Do that every year. Um, you know, if you can save yourself a few pennies on bait. Why not? Absolutely, why not? So, uh, let's just see if, if we can get a few more mackerel. Not had a full string yet. I've had threes and twos and ones. And no, full, no full strings yet. But they're coming in, so that's the main thing. Well, I've just moved again. Um, the birds have moved off a little bit, so obviously the shoals of mackerel moved. So uh, let's see if we can get a few more.
at the moment I'm up tired of them so I'm, I've, I've turned the engine off not to try and spook the uh, shell and I'm casting up towards them as well so hopefully um, that will work out for us yeah I've got some now when I want to get one or two feel well feels like one or two quite often not leave it down there don't reel in and you'll pick up some more see all the birds I don't know if you can see them the birds are all on the move again here we go look at that look at that rod bend look at that <laughs> it's great isn't it love it absolutely love it what childhoods were made of wasn't it there's only one by feel of it there's only one oh no no there's a few on there actually there we go folks look at that oh one's dropped off never mind so as i was saying just get the scorcher like that oh no way done anyway Not bad sized mackerel. Ooh. So there we go. So not bad sized mackerel actually to be fair. Ooh, hey. There we go, back in the water. So uh that's it, bit of mackerel in, great fun. Probably gonna see the smile on my face. Absolutely love it. But you know, in, in these sort of conditions, you can see why people come out of here in the sibs you know and kayaks and the rest of it absolutely beautiful and why not and it's probably one of the perfect crafts really for doing this because it's not too much noise and sound you're not going to split the shoal and uh there we go tight lines everyone hope you enjoyed this small little session on mackerel in don't forget if you would and you're a regular uh, user or viewer i should say don't forget feel push the button to subscribe it all helps the channel and make these little videos and videos and ventures happen.